New Year's Eve. So happy New Year's Eve. Check stuff on my camera. I was having my little breakfast. And I'm kind of jumping into this vlog without any explanation of why I've been gone for the last three months, but I'll get into that later, I guess. I have to enter in names for my Instagram giveaway to pick out a winner. So that's gonna take me quite a bit of time entering everyone's name. I wish there was like an easier way to do this. If there is, let me know. I literally have to enter in every single username, plus a bonus entry if they did like the bonus um, story. If you guys didn't know, I was doing a giveaway on my Instagram, which if you have not noticed, has completely changed into like a bookstagram. Did not intend to do that, but I think that's pretty much like where I'm going with my social media. Again, I'll get into that later. There's this website called Wheel of Names, and you pretty much just enter in every single name on here, and it's going to do a little spinny thing and pick a winner. Okay. I'm just gonna hold the camera because it's not staying up and Lacey keeps knocking it over. So it's New Year's Eve and I haven't been here in a while. I tried to film a couple of times just uh, with an update explaining why I've been gone, but I ended up not liking the footage and deleted everything. But pretty much I've been just taking a break from myself and my mental health. You know, this year has been really, really hard for me. You guys know, obviously, the big thing that happened was my dad passing in January and ever since then the year has been just really tough and really took a strain on my mental health. I think this is probably one of the worst years for my mental health. There were just like a lot of things that were going wrong um, with me like physically, emotionally, mentally and I really just wanted to take some time for myself to Get myself together and prepare for the new year because I want to start the new year off in a better mindset. I've just pretty much just been working on myself and starting this self-love uh, journey, healing journey, I guess you could say, because I'm definitely working on that and healing the traumas that I've been through and acknowledging the things I need to work on within myself and with other people. So that is pretty much that, just to make it short and sweet. But I'm very excited for this new year. I hope you guys are too. I have so many plans and goals for myself. I really hope 2023 will be a lot better than this year. And I have a good feeling about it because 2023 and three is one of my favorite numbers, and one of my one of my lucky numbers. So crossing my fingers that everything's gonna go well. Let's switch up. The view here. She my booby. My sleepy booby. She's going to the groomers tomorrow. So today's New Year's Eve and I want to clean the apartment. It's been a total mess ever since um, the holidays because of it's just been really crazy and busy. So we kind of neglected keeping the apartment clean. I did get like a new monitor stand for my desk, so I want to put that together and see how it looks. I have like a long list of like things I need to do and um, parts of the apartment that I need to clean. I definitely don't think I'm going to get all of that done today, but I'm going to try to do at least one room at a time because I have the kitchen, I have um, the living room and dining room, and I have our bedroom and bathroom. So. Yeah, but I have a three-day weekend, so hopefully <laughs> that's enough time for me to clean everything. You know, start off with a clean slate, a fresh start, and yeah. I love the smell of dog's paws.
finally done cleaning for the most part. I'm just eating some leftovers, spring rolls, and some chicken wings with rice. This package, I wanted to show you guys just a whole bunch of like planner and stationery. Um, if you guys didn't know, I am using a Hobonichi Weeks as my planner and I'm obsessed with it. So I've been buying like a ton of stickers and stuff for the planner as well as my journal because I've been journaling a lot lately too. So um, this is my planner for the year. I got some stuff from this site or this um, shop called Kubo and Lucy, I think. So I thought I would share with you guys whoever is interested. So, oh, this is nice. I think this is a freebie. Came in this clear pouch, paper clips. Um, this is really cute. It's like a, a leaf paper clip. And then some stickers. This is the name of the shop, Kubo and Lucy. Got some washi tape. I've been obsessed with washi tape lately. I've been collecting as much as I can. So this one has like paper cranes on it. And it's like a pretty mauve color. Coffee and like drinks, like a cafe theme, which is cute. Matcha latte, I think. I don't even remember which one this is, but their coffee one with has, and it has like gold foil on it. So that's pretty. I got just a bunch of stickers and I think I got some magnets too. Moon magnet, it's like a pretty gold. I got the daisy pin and um, I don't know if you can see the back of it. There's another sticker sheet, it's like a dim sum, which I thought was cute. Um, I got this little paperclip charm. A whole bunch of different stickers to use in my planner and my journal. So this one's like a cafe one. Like food with a gold foil. Another food one, flowers with gold foil. This one's really pretty. And then some clear stickers. So yeah, this is my planner and I'll show you guys a little bit more of it. I've been in it since the first week of December, so I haven't been using it for that long yet, but so I will share that with you guys. Sauce tastes like um chick fil a Does it? <laughs> what are you doing? We went to Barnes and Noble for one book, but they didn't have it. They said they had one coffee, but it was reserved. So I walked out with nothing, which is a surprise, but so that they would get more copies in um, fairly soon. So I'm going to pick it up whenever they have it. But now we're at the gym. Getting a quick workout in. Walking downtown and I'm okay 
He's got it all figured out. That's what they all say, yeah. Everyone's looking at me, thinking that I'm different. Everyone's looking at me, thinking that I'm living. But I don't really care what they all say. It's easier said than done. package from Target because I had a gift card from Christmas. Guess what I got? Oh, Lacey, you're in the way. So I got two new books. These are both memoirs. I got the Jeanette McCurdy, I'm Glad My Mom Died, and then the Tom Felton Before the Wand. If you guys didn't know, this is Draco Malfoy from Harry Potter. So naturally, I had to get it because I um, had the biggest crush on Draco Malfoy when I was younger. So can't wait to read this. And I heard nothing but good things about this. I honestly didn't really watch Jeanette McCurdy growing up, like on iCarly or any of the other shows that she was in. But I just heard the book was really good, so I wanted to read it. And then I got one clothing item. These are some sweats from this brand, Wild Fable, from Target. I actually have two of the same sweats in um, different colors. I have a gray a cream and then I wanted to get the black because um, I still had some money on my gift card to use. I really really love these sweats. They're very comfortable. Um, I'll actually try them on for you guys right now. So I can't really see them that well because they're black. I should have like demonstrated the other colors that I have for you guys but they have pockets. They're super comfy. They're like flared at the bottom. I am 5051 and they're a little bit long for me. So when I wear these out, I will have to wear like a shoe that has like some sort of, of a platform so they don't drag on the ground. Do you see how like long they are at the bottom? But yeah, that's what they look like. So for dinner, or what time is it? It's like 3.30, late lunch, early dinner. We're just having some longanisa eggs and rice, like a Filipino breakfast. Yeah, we were gonna have this for breakfast, but we woke up kind of late, so we're just gonna have it now. If you guys don't know what Langanisa is, it's kind of like a Filipino sausage. It's kind of sweet, but it's really good. Same brand, yeah, it's the same brand as the one that makes the cakes. <laughs> Is the whole entire thing? Let me see. Like, wait, wait, wait. Jesus, oh my goodness. Wow. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, it's like a cookie. Have some of the sticks. 